who don't run over the 2400 too often, but such is the case today. Now they're all in. The light is on. Gates open. They're off and racing. Contrition may have missed the start. Let's talk a deal. First to hit the ground. Two smoking barrels and Scarlet Tuft. He began well. There's Hostage of War. He's striding forward towards the lead, as is his custom. Go below, trying to find a spot. Three wide early. Then Bernie's Tiger. Drifting back, Tappy's Lad. He's out to third last as they head down the straight. They took, went back on Chocolatier. In contrast to last time here when he led. And last of all is Salago. Going to the turn out of the straight. 18.50 left to run. Hostage of War crosses to the rail and skips away to lead by two. Let's talk a deal second but immediately off the fence. Two smoking barrels in third and Scarlet Tufty travelling in fourth. Next pair Bernie's Tiger inside of Contrition Go Millo can't get in. Stuck three wide Two to Tappy's land over on the inside of Chocolatier and two and a half to Salago at the tail end. By the mile heading to the back straighter and she's trying to slow things down on Hostage of War leading from Let's Talk a Deal. Now Go Millo still three wide but pushing on towards the top. Meanwhile two smoking barrels sits pretty in fourth Fourth, and Scarlet Tufty ridden a bit more conservatively today, fifth on the outside. Followed then at the head of the others as they go down the back by Chocolatier, Bernie's Tiger, Contrition, Tappy's Lad, just sitting back, letting it all unfold in front of him. He's second last, and the Ruffy Salago whips them in. 1,100 left to run. Hostage of War trying to lead all of the way at the 2,400 leads from Let's Talk a Deal. Go below will sleep well tonight. He's been three wide from the get-go. Two smoking barrels in contrast continues to get the good run over on the Rail. Scarlet Tufty between the pair. Bernie's Tiger coming off the bid. 900 out. Then Contrition. Chocolatier trying to make ground three wide, but currently not doing so. Tappy's Lad second last. Still six to seven off the lead. He'll stay all day though. And Salago whips them in. Coming up to the home turn. 600 left to run. Still Hostage of War bobbing in the lead. One length. Let's talk a deal. Scarlet Tufty ridden hard. Two smoking barrels now. The jock starts to get a bit anxious as they come to the turn. Tappy's Lad's now up to fifth. He's threading the needle making good ground at the right time then Bernie's Tiger Tappy's Lad trying to force a run of the straight not quite enough room, two smoking barrels come through, oh they're all flat to the boards and Scarlet Tufty ran to the lead Tappy's Lad is out now and giving game chase, Scarlet Tufty in front Tappy's Lad on the outside, go below boxing away, Scarlet Tufty he's run his race and Tappy's Lad raced up, roared away, too strong at the 2400 metres Tappy's Lad too good, beat Scarlet Tufty, third over the line Go below, pretty good run after being three wide all the way. Then Contrition, two smoking barrels. Well, it had every possible hope. Then let's talk a deal. Chocolatier, Bernie's Tiger, Hostage of War and Salago was last throughout. Tappy's Land, the winner. Won at Doombin a fortnight ago. And good again today. You just knew that, you just knew at about the 600 that he was making ground and he'd be picking them off one by one by one because he's strong at the end of his races and a lot of those aren't. And that's how it